Okay. What's going on, you guys? All right, so uh, here to do a tag video for uh, what I'm doing the hashtag Seven Days of Tag. Um, again, if you guys want to do it, uh, you can um, type in your responses down below, or you can actually do a video, do the hashtag, you know, so everybody can see it, and I can even watch it, you know, to see what you guys say. So this is the 19 questions about music tag. Okay, uh, let's see where we go with this. <laughs> Question one. Which band slash artist do you own the most albums by? The artist that I own the most albums by is going to be Prince. It just is what it is. What was the last song you listened to? <laughs> it was uh, Same Script, Different Cast by Whitney Houston and uh, Deborah Cox. What is in your CD player right now? Okay, well, I don't really have a CD player, but I was listening to Whitney's Greatest Hits, so there you go. What was the last show you attended? If you guys remember from the last video, it was, uh, again, that was a while ago. Uh, Nelly and the St. Lunatics concert. Uh, what was your greatest show you've been to? Well, damn it, it was that one. I mean, sorry. <laughs> What was the worst show you ever been to? Don't have one. What is the most musically involved you've ever been? Okay, um, when I was in high school, I was actually um, in a male acapella group. So it was during our first year. Wasn't our second semester? Yeah, it was our second semester. And it started off where, you know, my, my high school was fairly new. So they had like, I think it was like one or two weeks where they had like different types of program where you could like pick what you wanted to do and you like you can go to those. So I went to the Mill Acapella group because at that time I was in a got well, I just came out of a gospel choir and I was singing bass. So I was like, hey, why not? And you know, we did, you know, some um, runs, this and the third, blending. And I mean, it worked so good that we actually remained a group and we would uh, perform uh, for the school at different events for Valentine's Day or Sweetie's Day. One of the packages we would come in, we would serenade all that good jazz. So, yeah, that was, I, I'm trying to remember how the question was. That was the most musically I've been involved. So, what show are you looking forward to? I don't have one. I mean, I probably, like, more than likely when I go to Europe, that's probably when I'm actually going to start going to shows. So, yeah what is your favorite band shirt got no fucking band shirt moving on what musician would you like to hang out with for a day damn that is a good question who the fuck would I like to hang out with for a day I mean that is a damn that's a good ass question I'm just gonna no. Eh. I'll have to say Usher, like, yeah, that, that's it. I mean, yeah, Usher. <laughs> um, who is one musician or group you wish would make a comeback? Fuck, I, I mean, again, most of the artists that I like, unfortunately, have already passed on. But, and again, I haven't been listening to more, a lot of modern music, so if I happen to throw somebody out there, and if, and if they already have that, I'm out, just let me know. But, hey, fuck it. Bring Ron back. <laughs> you know what? Actually, what I would like is, I would just like for Ron and R. Kelly just to just have a whole album where it's almost like a story uh, literally of them kind of going at it and just the ins and out and even do like a video type album too not no trapped in the closet type shit but i think that would be cool but yeah right honestly um who is one band slash artist you've never seen live but always wanted to it was donna summers like i fucking love donna i love the disco era to be holy fucking honest like it was just something about that and i love donna like Again, she was crying on Queen of Disco, but I fucking love Donna. But again, you know, passed on. Um, 
Name four or more flawless albums. Fuck. Okay. 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 Um. Whew. Shit, this is gonna get me in trouble. To me, <laughs> to me. Um, I think Beyonce's B Day album. I think that was pretty solid. I think that was a pretty solid album. Um, Usher's Confession album. I think was pretty much solid. More or less. I think he had deluxe version. If I'm not mistaken, like I really loved that. Um, who else? Jay Holiday's first album, like I like I bumped that a whole fucking lot and Lloyd Street Love. I think those were like four solid albums that and I'ma throw a fifth one out there even because I, I can't not talk about Mary, but Mary for Mary J. Blige had a lot of fucking solid albums, man. <clears throat> I mean it, it fucking share my world, no more drop. Damn it, look, I, I gave y'all a couple extras, damn it, leave me alone. Um how many concerts have you been to total? One. Who have you seen the most? I've only seen one concert, okay? I, look, look, look. Don't judge me. Shut up. What is your favorite movie soundtrack? Dreamgirls. And I fucking loved Eddie. Like, Eddie fucking killed that shit for me. Um, what was the last musical phase before you... Or what was your last musical face before you wisened up? I don't have one because I grew up with, like I said, with my, like my mom, like, okay, my father listened to a lot of, um, come on, funk and hip hop. My mother listened to, well, we could say the Dusties, but she was listening to the 60s, the 70s, the 80s, you know, R&B, disco, soul. So I grew up listening to the greats, you know, Johnny Taylor, Luther Vandross, you know, Donna Summers, Whitney Houston, Shirley Murdoch. Like I grew up listening to that, so I'm sorry. I I, I was already wise <laughs> a long time ago. What is your guilty pleasure that you hate to admit liking? Okay. So I've downloaded <laughs> two songs that it is a guilty pleasure of mine. Um, it happened to be that I've been uh, reviewing Love and Hip Hop for a while, so <sighs> Mariah Lynn's Once Upon a Time Not Long Ago, I Was a Ho, and I'm admitting that I won't take it back because I did the shit. I don't know, like, I like, I, I bought the damn single, okay, so don't fucking judge me. And, <laughs> and Mama D's in that order, in that order. <laughs> I don't like I don't know, but those are two guilty pleasures that I probably shouldn't admit that I like, but I do. So I think that was that that was the last question. So that was the 18 questions about music tag. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys on the next video. Peace. <laughs>